Cancer. Welcome to your reading. This is gonna be an overall general energy reading for my Cancers. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. <laughs> Keep in mind my readings messages are timeless, so I trust that when they find you, they find you at the right at the right time. Cancer, I hope you're doing well. I hope this message finds you while you're in good health and good wealth. You're gonna get an overall energy for your reading. Queen of Wands. Okay, Cancer, you're definitely, um, you're feeling good. You're feeling yourself. You're feeling connected. Queen of Swords on the bottom. You are definitely clear on the things you want to do, the things, the people you allow around you. You're very clear about what you want and you're going to get it. You're not, yeah, you're not confused at all on the split. Seven of Cups reverse. Um... You're definitely, you could be being seen right now. We also have the Seven of Swords on the split. So, you could be making a plan, making your next move, and Seven of Pentacles on the split. What the fuck? Seven, seven, seven? Oh, that's a tad. Um, Cancer. Whoa. Cancer, whoa. You are definitely, um, something big is happening in your life right now. I feel like something that you've wanted for a long time is really yeah it could be a soulmate connection um but it's like you you've just you freed yourself from these habits these people places and things that were not in alignment with you anymore that were not vibrating on your frequency um with the queen of swords you were very um clear about what needed to be removed um this devil energy and now with the queen of wands being your overall energy it's like you or either moving into the life that you have like kind of always wanted queen of cups on the bottom or you are about to be entering a time period that is very very abundant for you um it's going to kind of make you wonder how the old days ever how the old days ever got so bad you know but I feel like you're freeing yourself from some type of devil energy um, and you're being very decisive about it. Um, your spirit guides are definitely with you at this time. We just saw 777 in the deck, like all different suits. So Cancer, you on some shit. Let's see what's in your spread. Here and shuffle. Cancers. Queen of Wands. Could be dealing with the Queen of Wands. Could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. <laughs> Grab this card. But you also could just be finally like stepping up for yourself in a big way, being very clear on the boundaries that you have for yourself. Yeah, you are not being fooled by anything or anybody anymore. There's a release of fear happening. In the center, we have the Hierophant reverse, doing things in a very different way than usual because you're out of this cycle of pain. You're free now. It's like it's a new you. People could be finding you very attractive right now, Cancer. You're walking away, walking away, moving on to better days, refinding your balance, vibrating on a frequency that is very attractive it's like magnetic almost um and i think this could just be you finally seeing yourself in a new light like feeling empowered for setting these boundaries and moving away from these people places and things that were leading that were causing an unbalance in the past um to start your reading off we have the moon in reverse and that is a card of cancer seven of wands what's up with the sevens Seven, seven, seven. Cancer, some cancers are born in July. That is the seventh month of the year, too. Interesting. But, um, yeah, moon in reverse to start your reading off. Then we have the Hierophant reverse in the middle and the Ten of Swords reverse to end your spread. Cancer. <laughs> it's almost like you entered a new reality. It's like leaving whatever it was when you release yourself of this devil energy or when you do release yourself of that devil energy it's like 
you are going to be approaching life, going about life in, in a very unusual way for you. Like, like um, completing that cycle, leaving that pain is going to lead to you going about your life, seeing your life, um, the people you allow in your life. It's going to just almost feel like, a, like you're in a different world, you know? Could be done with the Taurus. Okay. Yeah, so clarifying the moon in reverse, we have the king of swords reverse. In the past, somebody or someone was trying to cloud your vision, your insight, your intuition, your knowing. They were trying to instill fear or kind of the idea of fear, meaning like, for example, like someone could be trying to make you feel like if you don't have them, then you will have nothing. Or if you, um, yeah, just trying to trying to instill fear in subtle ways, I would say. Clarifying the Hierophant reverse or the Nine of Pentacles reverse. You could definitely be um, meeting some new people or you have just met some new people that you are. And I feel like in the past you were very okay with being alone. Being alone might have felt very comforting to you but it's like now you're freeing yourself or you've been freed of by spirit these illusions that were once these narratives that you once believed these false narratives with the king of swords clarifying that um because you have freed yourself of that it's like now you're you're finally feeling like outgoing again i feel like you were in a period you were in a period of deep pain, guilt, shame. You were in a period of just deep, like, psychological anguish, agony. And you have just, you freed yourself. Once you freed yourself from these illusions, start making new connections with new people, places and things, redefining, um basically redefining the rules of your life like the way that you thought things were you realized they didn't have to be that way <laughs> you know the illusions just made you believe they had to be that way so then you start kind of just changing as a person and because now you're free with the page of wands clarifying the ten of swords now it's like you're feeling inspired again to kind of try new things be outgoing um just experience life on a different level be more in the present I would say. Hmm. Queen of Wands being your overall energy. You're definitely doing something that is Nine of Pentacles reverse again. That is, I feel like other people are involved or other people are really seeing you, especially with that Queen of Wands. Other people are seeing you, seeing the new you, seeing the you that is free of the pain, that is free of the past lies <laughs> that you were believing in. They're seeing a version of you that they have maybe never seen before. Yeah, and it's because you're just walking away from anything that was inauthentic, anything that was not vibrating on the Queen of Wands frequency. Hmm. Cancer, cancer, cancer. It's a pretty good reading. Hmm. You could be making a lot more money than you're used to. It could be saving, it could be like kind of protecting your energy more than you used to. I think that, I think although you're around more people and maybe more people are seeing you, I think you're protecting your energy in a very different way than you used to. You're not really allowing others to um, like in, intrude or impede, like you're not allowing others to walk all over you or anything near that. Like. You're being very clear and decisive with your boundaries, where you stand, what you believe in, and you're not letting anybody change that. <laughs> because that in the past, with that devil um, in reverse, the thing you had to free yourself from, I feel like within that, you learned a lot of lessons about these illusions that you were believing in, thinking that maybe you didn't need to Queen of Cups, yeah, you're just loving yourself differently these days on a different level, on a higher scale. 
on a deeper level. Clarify the moon in reverse and the king of swords in reverse spirit. Page of cups reverse. Okay. The empress. Could be dealing with the Taurus. Three of wands. Okay. Bottom, we have the five of pentacles reverse. <clears throat> You're no longer in a place where you feel scared to be seen. I feel like in the past you were playing small cancer. And when I say be seen, it, it could be on multiple levels. Seeing yourself, um, allow, or yeah, allowing yourself to be seen by yourself, like the real you. Um, with the empress in the middle, you could, could be being seen in ways that are just kind of more owning owning how beautiful you really are and being comfortable with that and being comfortable putting that out into the world or expressing that out in the world. And I think that could be what has been a very big change for you, Cancer, with the Hierophant reverse, Nine of Pentacles reverse, and the Empress. This is like, you could definitely be dealing with the Taurus, but also, um, these are very, with the Hierophant in reverse, it's like you're doing something way, like it's opposite day almost, <laughs> you know, it's like it's opposite day. And the Knight of Pentacles is a very independent energy, but you have yours in reverse. So it's like, I feel like with the Empress and the Hierophant and the Knight of Pentacles, you are just, you're okay and comfortable with the fact with the with the person that you are you know you're, you're you're realizing that the cycle of pain that you were in was trying to make you not feel comfortable with that with that person that you are they were trying to make you doubt yourself so as, as it trying to make it seem like you didn't have many options there was no takeoff was going to happen um in regards to however you see it fit in your situation these are all just lies that were told that you have broken free from and now you're seeing the truth and that's why you're owning and comfortable with who you are with the queen of wands and the empress um you could be a very nurturing person you could be very very connected to your intuition right now um moving forward we have the ten of swords reverse page of wands and the three of wands like i said you're trying these new things you're trying to see which direction you really want to move in now because now you're, you're seeing and understanding that you're free of like whatever past lies and narratives you completed that cycle with the ten of um swords reverse you completed that cycle so now you're like okay now i see myself now i fucking love who i am because i've always been fucking awesome yes you have cancer um now what do i do you know i think that's a really good energy to be sitting in i think it is up to you where you go from here um the possibilities are endless because you see yourself now you're free of whatever in the past was trying to make you not see yourself or let you see yourself your card yeah now you're on your you're walking into some really really happy days you're going to be feeling very enlightened you're going to be feeling very very balanced and you're not going to allow anything or anyone inauthentic to impede on your new happiness and make you feel less than at all. We're gonna get some cards of advice from Spirit from our little baby tarot deck. Hmm. King of Wands popped out. Six of Wands. My eight of cups reverse okay as long as you your advice from spirit is to really own your power own your power cancer anyone that tries to make you doubt your power leave that leave them go find a people or group of people or just whatever that is going to empower you you're walking into very victorious days very um 
very happy days cancer it looks like it looks like you're gonna start getting all of the things that you've been wanting and the only reason that you were not getting those in the past is because there was something or somebody that was casting illusions over you over your life trying to make you feel like you you wouldn't you won't survive without them or it was just a, a part of yourself that was not ready to be seen out of fear but it's like those illusions stripped away stripped away and now you're um you're dreaming new dreams and you're doing it in the comfortability of your own skin feeling very present trying new things and succeeding at whatever you're attempting that is wonderful cancer all right that is your reading that is your advice from spirit i'll see you soon